Hey everybody, it's your Space Coast correspondent, James Sparvero, and what a thrilling day here at Cape Canaveral Space Force Station. That new spaceship we've talked so much for being delayed, well, it finally launched with two astronauts who are now on their way to the International Space Station. After Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams finally got off the ground, I had a chance to talk to people with Boeing and with NASA about responding to the Starliner program's harshest critics. What would you like to say to those who may have even called for the cancellation of the program after all the delays? There are those who thought Butch and Sonny would never fly. We talk to our team a lot about just ignoring a lot of the stuff that you read. We focus on the positive, we focus on the accomplishments, and we learn from the setbacks that we've had. So the astronauts and the spacecraft are now on track to rendezvous with the space station afternoon on Thursday. That's when our coverage continues here on News 6 and ClickOrlando.com.